Hello Oswald, my name is Pam Jenkins, and I have been interested in your work on the Jigsaw Killer for a while now. I'm currently writing a book on the subject, and would you really like your feedback? Please let me know if we can have a meeting. I have already... I already know what you look like, I have a picture of you on my desk. Hello, Pam Jenkins. She's definitely not stalking the guy. That's alright, that's alright, Cesar. If you need to sleep, you need to sleep, you know. Just got to get some sleep, yo. Let's try to get to the second floor. See you later, Cesar. Good night. Sleep well. God. Oh crap. Crap, crap, crap. I just shivved him. <laughs> okay, so... The scissors are good for shivving. <laughs> good to know. Alright, in before... Yep. There's a toilet again with a lot of needles and a key. Gotcha key. I thought I had to go upstairs, not downstairs. Find a way to the second floor. Let's go downstairs, why not? That's the most obvious thing to do. You know, to be honest, this game is scarier than, than the evil within. Ooh. I like, I like unlocking Jigsaw's chests. But not when they're full of junk. Ah, oh, let's pick up the pipe because the pipe is a lot better. Why do I have a bad feeling about this place? It's a workbench, but nothing to grab from it. All right. So this guy is just permanently dead. Do you think I can uh, finish this game today, Prime? Just gonna check for traps. Cause I don't trust that baby. Jigsaw work table. Well, um, as far as I've read upon it, there are seven victims, and I've already saved four, so there's three more to go. So let's say about an hour per victim. Should be doable, right? There's a six on there. Give me the key oh, now. crap! Ugh. Ugh. Oh, yeah! Let's take a closer look, because I like how this actually works. So oh, beautiful. A two? And an eight. 
Six to eight. Six. Two. That was kind of easy, though. That lock was kind of easy. I said, don't get near me. You're dead. No, I'm not. I'm I'm alive and kicking. As far as I can see, I'm very alive. But what if I really am dead? And this is just a dream. Is this it? The test of death. You waste your life looking for tests, looking for an easy fix to your pathetic life. I know. That's why I wanted to be tested by you to change it. You waste your life looking for a way to be tested. And what is the point of the test? I don't know how to live without it. This guy reached zero. <laughs> Locate Obi's trap? What's that? Locate the cream of Obi's trap. That doesn't sound too great though. Trap. We just check the map. Diffuse. Okay. There's nothing in here. All right, let's let's fix this thing. There we go. There's a dude. He has a crutch. <clears throat> Gonna punch you right in the face. And thank you for your crutch. That broken glass right there or something. Ah, god damn it. I stepped on some broken broken glass again and I just have some bloody feet. As you can see. Bloody foot. Ah, glass again. Cut by a surgeon's hand. Okay, so there's a puzzle right there. What's that? Case file. Uh, rush chairs. Some rush chairs have been distributed among the wings. The design is old enough to be in a museum, but these are not exhibits. Benjamin Rush, a father of the American psychiatry and signer of the Constitution, developed these chairs to slow blood flow to the brain, preventing madness. As we know, that is completely ridiculous. We are using these chairs as temporary isolation chambers until the isolation cells can be renovated. There's a camera. There's another work table. Why do I not feel comfortable in this place when I hear somebody yelling again like that?
crematorium. The Whitehurst crematorium oven is a state of the art in every way. Uh, the oven is heated to 870 to 980 degrees Celsius to ensure that most of the organic matter is vaporized. The body is stripped of any jewelry or metals before being inserted into the main chamber called the retort. Uh, please note that burning more than one body at a time is illegal in this country, though this is generally an uh, unenforceable law. The matter that remains is usually small bone fragments and those are processed in a grinder called Cremulator. These are the remains that are given to the family or in the case of wards of state dispersed. God damn. There was a pipe. There it is. I'd rather have a pipe than anything else. Uh... Interesting. Uh, case file. There have been significant losses of John Doe's due to extensive experimental treatments, and we don't have the storage room in order to wait for the local crematorium to retrieve and process the bodies. To be frank, the corpses are piling up faster than we can get rid of them. I recommend we build a crematorium in the building. This would save us plenty of money over what the local crematorium is charging us and would give us the capacity uh, to process the bodies. I'm just quickly gonna heal because there's a high point here. There we go. Shopping cart. And eh, there's the gear. Just to start. Oh. I could have just turned off that thing a little while ago. Alright, Chicks, how you got something for me? No? Okay. X marks the spot. What the hell's gonna happen? I don't think that was supposed to happen though, but... It's in there. Oh, so by destroying, by, by by making his puzzle go off and blowing up, the weapon that was actually in that room got dispersed off. I can hear footsteps. They're not mine. Oh! Get him on! God damn it! That guy is annoying. <laughs> I couldn't kill him. For some reason, I just couldn't do enough damage to him. Am I now? I'm back here? Really?
Wasn't really anything behind this door, was there? Uh, there was only like a hypo in the gear. Just gonna leave this guy in there. Was a bit too close for comfort. Whew. Okay, we have found interesting results regarding treatment using fluids to generate a patient's mental status. In our initial tests, we found patients much more at ease after drawing 40 ounces of blood. We have expanded these tests to see if patients will become calmer after dehydration, removal of the prostate, removal of the salivary glands, salivary glands, and so on. God, what the- Whoa! Okay. Um. It's a dead end. No, it's not. It's not. It's not a dead end. X marks the spot. Nice. We have found X. I think I might actually have to fight somebody here again. Because I hear footsteps. That's like the creepiest thing in this game are the footsteps. There's nothing here? No. Okay. And the bomb. <laughs> Well, it's not a bomb. I think it's a shotgun. A bat. Don't mind if I do. I prefer a bat over anything else. A steel pipe can actually break a lot faster than a bat. That doesn't make sense, but... Wait, let's first see... Okay, there's nothing in it. Well, actually, I kind of need to use one. from the other side. Strike door number one. Blocked from the other side. I think this is the door that we need. Wait a minute. Yep. Then the first door on the right. Huh. Interesting. Locked. Glass. Okay, it's not this way yet. Wait. Did I just run around in a circle? I did. Damn it. <sighs> if I go through here, and I'm not in the right place. 
back there. But it's this door that I gotta go through again. To my left. I'm going. It's supposed to be here somewhere. I think this is where I gotta acquire the frozen hand. There we go. There we go. I got the frozen hand. Help, oh, Pipo. I'll take it. Now thanks to that guy, I actually did not get the chance to hear what Jigsaw said. A surgeon's hands fit, uh, holds the key to life. Great, it's locked. What's this? Contains hazardous biological material. Exercise extreme caution. <laughs> what if I say no? Oh god. What happened to this guy? God. What the hell's wrong with Jigsaw though? That's what you got. Just great. Just great. You enter one door, next one locks. Yep. Wait, what? Three minutes and thirty seconds, and what do we have to do? Activated two circuit boards. Where are they? There's one here, but there's steam. So let's turn off that thing. Should be able to do it. God damn it. I don't have, um. What, what are they called again? I don't have one of those things. Where will I find it? Yeah, there's one around here? Traps. Nothing found. Really? Where are they? Why can't I find them? There's supposed to be at least two, maybe. Oh wait, there's um... There we go, a couple or one. Okay, no more couplers at the moment. Right, let's just open one first. 
Oh god. It's one It's even harder than I thought it would be. Where's the other one? So I know that there's one coupler in in here. In one of these uh, lockers, so there has to be a second one somewhere. I will blow up. Because I can't find it. There it is. Maybe I still have time. I have 30 seconds. I have 30 seconds to figure this one out. It's exactly the same. Damn it! That was so close! <laughs> ah, now I know where the couplers are. <laughs> that was just close, though. Alright, Jiggy. Alright, so first let's go this way. I should actually turn on my flashlight just to have some more vision. Right. Pick that coupler. Turn off the valve. Let's go. Faster, faster, faster. That one's good. Wait, they're different now. Damn it. Uh completely different this time. It's not a problem though, but... Right, I have 2 minutes and 40 seconds to spare now. I, I can do this now. <laughs> I can easily do this now. Alright, let's go. Now watch out for that trap. Go! There it is. This is a different one as well. Uh, yeah, I gotta do this one like that. This one is exclusively for that one. Wait, I gotta get out. I gotta get out now. <laughs> okay. Come on. Don't get through the door before the bombs explode. Shouldn't be too hard. I've got a minute and 13 seconds to spare anyway. Perfect. Hey, I still had a minute. God damn it. I still had like a minute left and it exploded again. <laughs> 